Today's video is brought to you by Hex Gaming. Let me ask you a question. Do you need that competitive edge in that first person shooter, third person shooter? Are you just getting straight clapped by the competition? Or how about that raid in that console MMO? Do you need something to give you some ease for your next cooldown? Make your rotation a little bit simpler? Need some customizable buttons? Or do you just want a flashy controller? Visit Hex Gaming today and use promo code TONEC127 to get 5% off anything you order in the Hex Gaming store. That's hexgaming.com. Use promo code TONEC127 at checkout to get yourself a discount. Enjoy the video, guys. Hello ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Tanek127 and welcome back to Tanek FPS. Now I know guys, I've been gone for a little bit, you know, I haven't uploaded a video for about a week and stuff like that, but it's just been a really, really hectic one, so I do apologize about that, but I'm back, baby, and I'll have more Crossfire X news and stuff like that in videos for y'all soon, but I want to talk about another X today. And that's Tom Clancy's X Defiant. We finally have some news. The Twitter is finally active again in about five months. And I couldn't be more excited. Now, granted, I do cover X Defiant regularly on this channel when they are actually releasing news. So if you want to stay up to date on Tom Clancy's X Defiant, I highly suggest you subscribe today and like this video. <laughs> Let's go ahead and talk about today's information and today's news. So like I was saying, Tom Clancy's X Defiant Twitter is finally active Mark Rubin is finally talking again, but there's something even bigger going on. We have a, we have we have test news upcoming, and there is a new member of the development team, and this is what is so important. Now, let me talk about my good pal Rogue Company real quick. Rogue Company is a fun third-person shooter, but one thing I love about that game, I absolutely love, is the fact that Scott Gandhi is the head of it. He is a ex-professional Halo player. Meaning he knows what shooter players want in a game. Despite Rogue Company being a third person shooter and not a first person shooter. It's still an arena shooter. It's still a hero shooter. It's still in that similar genre of Halo. So Scott knows you know, what he's doing from a professional level. He's been there as a player and now he's there as a developer. And he has you know, the brain that works on both sides of the scale. Well we're about to get that treatment in Tom Clancy's X Defiant because professional Call of Duty player Patty P. It looks like I'm gonna assume judging by the jersey in this picture here he played for um, Evil Geniuses, Patty P aka Aix. He has joined the Ubisoft X Defiant team and he just announced it today. Well yesterday by the time you guys are watching this video and he put up a big thread Tom Clancy's X Defiant retweeted and everything Mark Rubin's all hype. People are excited. And I'm going to read it to you guys and I'm going to discuss my opinions on this current scenario. Patty P's note goes to say, About a month ago I announced I was closing a big chapter of my life and starting a new one. Retiring from completing, competing professionally and moving on to the world of game development. I promised you that I would be able to share some exciting news regarding that soon. Well that day has finally come. It is my pleasure to announce that I have joined the Ubisoft San Francisco studio, I'll be working on X Defiant, which is being led by industry veteran Mark Rubin, who helped create some of my favorite shooters ever. And if you don't know who Mark Rubin is, he is an X Infinity War developer. He's worked on games like COD Ghost and a lot of other awesome Infinity War titles. I think even like um, Modern Warfare 3, 2 and stuff like that. And um, honestly, guys, is he, he's just incredible. Say what you want about Ghost, but before the whole... Um, the whole EXO movement era started. Ghost was one of the best CODs we ever had. Just saying, in my personal opinion at least. I am joining an incredible, talented design team working on various aspects of the game. Camera, controls, game modes, weapons, factions, and more. As I mentioned before, I have been consulting since last October. And in mid-January, I joined full-time. Which I find awesome because um, one thing I do find really cool about the, um, the X Defiant team, they hit up a lot of pro players and content creators that were revolved around Call of Duty specifically to consult on this game. Even Om Drifter got to consult in this game way back. He said it was like in very early, early, early alpha um, 
alpha development when he was doing consulting for this game. I am extremely excited about things to come and sharing some of that with you. For starters, closed testing is coming back soon, so make sure that you are registered on our website. I cannot wait for you to participate. Getting your feedback is super important in making X Defiant the best game it can be. See you there, Patty P. And guys, this is awesome. This is amazing news. And I'm going to tell you guys why this is amazing news. Because there's something really unique here about good old Patty P that I want to bring up to you all on his Twitter. It goes to say that he is a game dev at Ubisoft, which, you know, obviously. But 2014 and 2018 Call of Duty World Championship plus 20 major wins. Now, what's unique about that is... um is he has been participating in professional Call of Duty during, you know, the last generation of gaming. Like, you know, during the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One era. And those are some of the ugliest days of Call of Duty. And I'm glad that, you know, he's got to experience that as a player because now he knows what the community doesn't want and what we can't stand in a shooter and what we are looking for in first-person shooters. You know, that means he's been there in COD through, you know, the skill-based matchmaking, the supply drop nonsense, the pay-to-win weapons, all that stuff this man knows about. And he's been a player, boots on the ground, fighting, you know, some of the most sweatiest tournaments ever in the middle of that Call of Duty era. And he knows what it's like being a player in that scene and being pressured by all that. And that is someone that we now have on our side with an upcoming first-person shooter that we're going to be getting on PC and consoles. And I honestly think that's great news to have somebody with that kind of experience, and I couldn't be more excited. Let me know how you guys are feeling about that down in the comments below. But anyway, y'all enjoyed today's video? Smash that like button. Remember, you want more x Defiant news, subscribe today. And I will see y'all in the next one. Peace out. Have a good one.